The president kind of upped the ante on earmarks last night. He said he's going to veto any bill that comes to his desk that has earmarks in it. Where does that leave you? Because you're now sort of the odd man out on this issue. Republicans have said they're not going to ask for earmarks. You have defended them. You say they're an important congressional power. But what do you do if the president says he's going to veto a bill with earmarks? Any president would love to be able to get more power, and that's what this is all about. It's usurping the power from the legislative branch of government and giving it to the, to the executive branch of government. I don't accept that. I have a constitutional obligation to do congressionally directed spending. The president wants more power. I don't want to give him any. Now, he may, he may be able to succeed on a short term, but uh, earmarks will come back. Congressionally directed spending will come back. John Cornyn's quoted in the paper saying they're coming back. He's head of the Republican Senatorial Campaign Committee. They're coming back. It's only a question of when. So are you going